Hi everyone, I'm LC May alongside Kevin Connell from Tie991.com. Alabama is getting a much needed week of rest. Nick Saban said that his team was both physically and mentally tired. And the most important thing about this week is players with injuries are getting much needed rest. So Kevin, can you tell us a little bit more about the injuries and the players that are getting that much needed rest? Right, well we actually had three injuries in that last game against Tennessee as many probably saw. They Able, they are forced off the field, had to be helped off in some cases. Eddie Jackson, Ronnie Harrison, the two safeties, as well as Dominic Jackson. Uh, but first with the, the safeties, Eddie Jackson, he's the starter, obviously. He's had a great year with interceptions. Everyone saw that Texas A&M game, I'm sure. And, uh, he's actually played the practice the last two days, so he looks fine. It was a knee injury. He had the ACL tear two years ago now, struggled with it a little bit last year, but he looks to be okay. And then moving on to Ronnie Harrison, he has an ankle sprain. Um, he, has, he has not practiced the past two days, missed today as well, uh, but we'll see. Obviously, we don't know. We still have a week until LSU, but maybe not a huge loss. We've still got some experience. Eddie Jackson, Gino are the starters. Um, and then we also have Jabril Washington, a veteran, as well as some other guys. So maybe not the biggest loss there, but with Dominic Jackson, he's hey. probably the biggest concern right now. He also has a high ankle sprain which Saban actually said yesterday in his Tuesday night press conference that it's a skeptical right now for him. Like, he may not be able to make play in this next game against LSU. Obviously, it's still a little, little bit away, but we'll have to see. It's actually funny, though, because Cam Robinson had the same injury, high ankle sprain against Tennessee last year, had to leave that game. Then they had the bye week before LSU, and people thought the same thing. They didn't think Cam Robinson was going to play in that game. He actually did play in the LSU game. Played pretty well, if I recall, and so um, and it was actually the same. said it was actually the same. They had a slight procedure of some sort on the ankle. Said that's what Jackson had as well as Robinson did. Yeah. So um, it's just interesting that it's playing out. So um, obviously it's a case by case basis, but it maybe shows he can play. But for right now he's not. But Brandon Green, he's he's filling in there. He's a junior. He's filling yeah. at right tackle right now. Ross Pierce. Right, Baker, he's left guard. Saban also mentioned him as a player that could slot over to there possibly, as well as Corn Curvin was another name that could play there. So interesting there, but we have a few guys that can come in, a few guys that are capable and veterans as well. Nothing too severe is the good news for the right. injuries. Well, well, I'm LC May reminding you to subscribe to the YouTube channel at Tide991 for more exclusive Alabama content.